Hey guys, Henry here, and today I'm gonna to give you a run through on how to set up your fire belly as a minimalist sleeping bag, hammock top quilt, and hammock under quilt. When using the fire belly as a minimalist sleeping bag and or hammock top quilt, you'll wanna cinch one end to create a foot box. Let me show you how to do that. All right, so we're gonna start off by taking the fire belly and making a foot box. And to do that, you're gonna find the top or the bottom. It's symmetrical, so you can actually use either side. And you're gonna find your webbing pockets with snaps, and you're gonna connect the left side to the right side, like so. From there, you're gonna find the cinch cord, and you're gonna pull it tight. And I like to do about halfway on each to get it even and then just pull it as tight as you can. And easy as that, you now have a foot box. And you can take that and wrap it around your feet like so. And you're all good. For tent and bivy campers, using the fire belly as a minimalist sleeping bag requires that you use a sleeping pad and our included sleeping pad straps. This will ensure to keep out cold spots throughout the evening. Let me show you how to set it up. All right, I'm gonna quickly show you how to set up the fire belly as a minimalist sleeping bag. Uh, as you see, we've already got the pad straps on the sleeping pad itself. They're set up at about width at the waist height, as well as right around where your shoulders, like right below your shoulders uh, would sit. And those are gonna connect in to the actual connection points on the fire belly. Um, you can see that we already made the foot box right here where we cinch the ends and snap that bottom connection. And then what all you have to do is take that next set of snaps and snap in to where you have the bottom two sets of snaps connected. Then we're gonna take the fire belly and flip it over towards the sleeping pad. I'm gonna pull the sleeping pad towards me and you're gonna connect in to the closest gear loop for ultimate protection and from dr cold drafts and all that type of stuff. And you're gonna snap that into the gear loop and that's gonna sit like so. And you're gonna do that on the top and on the bottom. And then from there, you're all set. You're ready to get in the fire belly itself. So you fold this down, open it up just to make it a little bit easier and just hop right in. Kind of slide your way down to the bottom and pull it tight. And if you want to make a draft collar up top, you're gonna cinch in the sides. to keep out all drafts. You kind of work the quilt under you, and there, you're all set. Now we're gonna set up the fire belly as a top quilt in hammock mode. And here we're using the Rue single, uh, but it works just as well with the Rue double. Uh, as you see, the fire belly is already in the hammock. Uh, this is because it's gonna be used with you on top as a top quilt. To do that, we're gonna start by making a foot box here. And here you see that I've already cinched both ends of your trail quilt equally to create that foot box. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna flip it over and you're gonna find the little pockets, there's five on each side, that have your little webbing snaps. And you're gonna connect that to the opposite side. And there's two snaps per pocket, so you're gonna hook all those up, up to about halfway. So you're gonna end at the middle point. So that's the second set of snaps. Then we're gonna find that third set right here. Once you've done that, you're at that middle point. You're gonna take the quilt, flip it over, and you're gonna hop right in. Making sure not to sit on the fire belly, get it out of the way. You're gonna pull yourself in and over that middle point and pull the foot box towards you that you created. 
And that now all gathered up will keep your feet toasty and warm. And then what you can do to make sure you have no drafts coming on the top side is you can find the cinch cord over here and pull that tight to make that tight around your shoulders, neck, everywhere. And now you're all set for the coziest night's sleep of your life. Here at Kamek, we're all about hammock camping, and it's easy to see why it's gained so much popularity over the years. But for new hammock campers, they often overlook a critical piece of insulation needed to keep them warm throughout the night, and that's an underquilt. Let me show you how to set up the fire belly as an underquilt. We're gonna set up our fire belly around our rue double, and for that, you're gonna need our underquilt conversion kit, which is found in the fire belly stuff sack. You're gonna have two of each, and it's a pair of cord that has two aglets on each end. You're gonna take that and hook it into your carabiner and then rest that on the hammock. As you can see, I already have the other side hooked up. The next step then is you're gonna cinch both ends of your fire belly. Similar to how you cinch the foot box as a top quilt, you're gonna do both ends for under quilt. And you wanna make sure that the shock cord is even on each side. And you're gonna take that. Once you've hooked up one end, you're gonna run it under Put your hammock in there, like so, and you're gonna find the aglets with the underquilt conversion kit that you set up already, and hook in the shock cord on each end. Once you've done that, you're gonna find the gear loops in your hammock and the loops located on your fire belly, and loop them through there's a total of six that you'll actually end up connecting to. Now that you've got all six of your loops connected, you're ready to get in. Quick pro tip, if you wanna raise the walls and tighten the fire belly around you, you can actually go and loosen the shock cord on each end equally to pull up your walls. And like that, you're all set. You can get in it and relax. I'm gonna quickly show you how to set up the fire belly as an under quilt around our single sized hammocks. It's a super fast and simple setup. Instead of needing a conversion kit, it clips right into the carabiner. You shock cord each end equally like you do for the root double. But instead of using a under quilt conversion kit, all you need to do is flip it out under your hammock, open it up, Get it in there, like so, and then take the two cords that are equally cinched and clip it right into your carabiners. You then, from there, do the same thing where you hook it up to the gear loops. And you're, there's six total, and you'll do all six. Now that you have all six gear loops hooked up, you can open up your hammock and hop in. <laughs> Thanks for watching. As with all Kamek products, your fire belly is covered by a lifetime warranty. Should anything go awry, we've got your back. Remember, go register your lifetime warranty at kamek.com slash register. Do it. Just do it. Go and do it. Right now. <laughs>